I literally stuffed 55 bags of plastic bait into this new Daiwa uh, lure binder. All right, so as you can tell, this is a little bit overstuffed. I definitely tried to put too much in. This is the new Daiwa large lure binder. Now, for years, whenever I had my plastic bait, um, I actually stored it in one of these Flambeau um, plastic bait holders. What happened also is I actually cracked the front there and I decided that I, need, I wanted to try something different. So I did see these, these were uh, brand new at the store. These just came out in 2022 and they hold quite a bit of bags. Again, I have over 50 bags of plastic bait in this thing and I almost guarantee that it's only sp probably supposed to hold around 40. But you can see some of the features, I'm just showing off some of the features in case you're interested in picking one of these up and you can actually see there's no reviews yet that I've seen on YouTube yet. So this here, you got all these pockets that are, they look like pretty tough looking zippers too. Um, pockets for packages of hooks, small bags of plastic bait, stuff like that. Uh, I have some beast hooks and some other hooks. I do have a terminal tackle tray, but it would be nice to have some extra stuff in there as well. And then it does come with five binders um that you can have there's clear plastic and it's pretty much just like a binder from high school you have the ring binder there and then each of these holds it depends on the size of the bait you're going to have so some of these i have um, 10 bags of plastic baits and other ones have closer to 20 and it really depends on your baits now i'll give you some close-ups uh too and again like i said this is over packed i'm definitely going to have to take some out of this because it is a little bit I'm trying to take less stuff fishing so if it doesn't fit in this it's not coming with me um, it does have a water resistant vinyl this is a water resistant vinyl I'm not sure if the zipper is actually waterproof probably not uh, obviously it can probably hold um, or withstand some some water because it's obviously built for fishing uh, it's obviously not waterproof though this is about $45 Canadian for the large one and I think the smaller ones about 35 don't quote me on that but uh, let's check it out so again, this is the large bag. This has premium water resistant vinyl. Um, it has nylon corrosion resistant zippers. And it has five, as I said, it comes with five sealable um, binder bags, as you can see. Can you get additional bags? I don't know, I haven't seen them at the store yet. This is a new product. I hope that you can, in case these break. I was kind of skeptical about these bags holding up. They seem like they're built pretty tough but uh, obviously having the ability to buy extra ones if they break would be good. So as you can see in this one, I kind of just have trailers. This one, I have my sort of finesse drop shot baits. This one is uh, stick worms. This one is um, like chatter bait, swim jig and flipping baits. And this one is uh, worms. And again, I got some hooks on here. It seems like a pretty nice little unit. Again, I'm gonna have to take some of this out so it all fits in. But uh, the fact is units like this are great, but unfortunately a lot of larger items like this or bigger packs of worms, they don't fit in this. And you have to fold the bag and sometimes the plastic is kind of warpy. So that's why I'm kind of staying away from this. These are in general, they're actually really good. I ran one of these for probably seven or eight years before it finally broke. But this holds a little bit more of a diverse of uh, different sizes of bags. So that's kind of what I'm going to go with. And like I said, I'm going to try to only bring what's in this bag. So that's kind of my deal. If it doesn't fit in this bag, I'm not going to bring it. So if you have any questions about this product, again, this isn't a review because I haven't been able to use it. I just got it today. We'll post some long-term reviews in the future. But if you have any questions, comment below.